Metal objects are often covered with thin layer of zinc to be protected from corrosion. Zinc plating on iron is performed in the solution of zinc salts through which electric current is passed. This experiment from Mel Chemistry Electroplating Set, we will depose its zinc on a copper plate, then we will also make beautiful shiny patterns on it. Take a zinc road and wrap it with a piece of cloth which will later absorb zinc salt. Then insert the wrapped zinc road into the straw. Wet an absorbent with hydrochloric acid taken from the reagent pack. Remove the residues of copper oxide by wiping the copper plate with the wet absorbent, and then wipe it again with the dry side of the absorbent. Now connect the clear copper plate with the anode, which is possibly charged, and the improvising zinc pen with the cathode, which is negatively charged. Now we need to fill the pen with a special type of ink. Add two drops of zinc sulfate inside the straw as shown in the video. Slowly move the pen on the surface of the copper plate. As you can see, the improvised pen does really act as a real pen, but except for that it has metal zinc ink instead of pen ink, which makes shiny marks on the copper plate. This shiny mark is formed because of electrochemical reactions. Due to the electric current, zinc travels through the solution to the plate. Positively charged ions move from positively charged zinc road to negatively charged copper plate. The absorbent does not interfere the movement of the zinc ions from the straw to the copper plate as the ions are so tiny that they pass through all the pores of the absorbent, whilst if they were the size of a sand grain, they might have been stuck inside the absorbent. As zinc ions arrive to the surface of the copper plate, they add two electrons and settle on it as a form of metal layer. If you want to learn more about this experiment, please visit our Mel Science website.